This video explains the options you have available for analyzing the results of your Silk Performer load tests. Silk Performer offers several approaches to displaying, reporting, and analyzing test results. Captured measurements can be displayed in a variety of graphical and tabular formats. Baseline reports are detailed XML, XSL based reports that provide a summary table, transaction response time details, timers for all accessed HTML pages, web forms, and a list of all errors that occur. This information is available for all user types involved in your baseline tests. Silk Performance Explorer is used to monitor the performance of your test environment during testing. A fully comprehensive array of graphical features displays the results in user defined graphs with as many elements as are required. The results of different tests can be compared, and there are extensive features for server monitoring. Now I'll select data sources that captured performance information from the Silk Performer agent during a load test and add them to a localhost operating system graph. This will enable me to compare the server monitoring data and load test results captured during the test in a single graph. Click Select Graph on the Silk Performance Explorer workflow bar. Select General and click Finish. A summary graph of server-side measurements captured on the agent, the local host in this case, during the most recent load test appears. I'll then drag additional client-side measurements into the graph to facilitate root cause analysis of any detected errors across both client-side and server-side measurements. Silk Performance Explorer offers a comprehensive HTML-based overview report that combines user group data from the baseline report file with time series test result information. In Silk Performer, click the Analyze Load Test link. The overview report is then displayed in Silk Performance Explorer. The overview report is made up of several sections. The General Information section includes administrative information in tabular form as well as important load test results in a graphical form. The charts display the number of active virtual users, response time measurements for transactions, and the number of errors that occur over time. The summary section contains summary measurements in tabular form. These are aggregate measurements for all virtual users. The first table provides general information, such as the number of transactions that were executed and the number of errors that occurred. All the following tables provide summary information relevant to the type of application that was tested. This section provides enlarged versions of the charts included in the report. Click a reduced version of a chart to jump to the enlarged version and vice versa. Silk TrueLog Explorer provides full visual verification under load capabilities for various application types using its TrueLog on Air technology. TrueLog Explorer allows you to combine extensive content verification checks with full error drill down analysis during load tests. With Silk Performer TrueLog technology, you can identify errors that occur with only a subset of users when your application is under heavy load. For most applications, this is the type of load that's most often experienced once an application is deployed in real world environments. The API node of the first encountered transaction that includes an error is selected. Click Find Next to advance to the API node that generated the error. This particular error was generated by a failed content verification function because an expected text string didn't appear on the web page. Based on this result, you might choose to perform root cause analysis on the error to determine why the content wasn't received from the web server. Thanks for watching.